Hey, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Earlier this month, as I posted, Microsoft rolled out Power Toys version 0.94. And as I mentioned in the video, which will be linked down below and in the end screen, Microsoft added features like a new search bar for easier navigation here at the top of the app, a shortcut conflict detector, and an improved gliding cursor mode for accessibility. Check the video out for more info. Now, just to let you know that if you were trying to or have been trying to install Power Toys version 0.94 and you couldn't get the app installed, it was failing to install, just to let you know that you're not alone because after the update was rolled out, um, Microsoft got a lot of feedback from users that the installer would often fail with a bootstrapper error, which is this error. And apparently the problem was showing up across every installation method. So that's including GitHub, downloads, Winget, and even the Microsoft Store because Power Toys can be downloaded from the Microsoft Store, as you may well know. Now, just to let you know that if you were experiencing this problem, that Microsoft has released version 0.94.1 to address the issue. And the update introduces one fix, that's all. With Microsoft saying in the change log, and I'm quoting, resolve the installer setup problem, enabling successful installation from GitHub, Winget, and Microsoft Store by fixing this error, as mentioned. Following the rollout of this patch, you should be able to download and install Power Toys without running into the error. Power Toys 0.94.1 is already available for download from GitHub. Alternatively, Microsoft says, as mentioned, you can grab it from the Microsoft Store. So if you were experiencing that problem, just to let you know with the latest update, Microsoft says it has addressed that issue. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.